Francia, the land of Charlemagne and the bitter prize of Ragnar, sacked Paris for a fortune in silver and sorrow. Now a new king rises, uniting Franks against Norse in open battle, and casting angry eyes toward England. I must stop this mad king from sending war across the sea. Already his armies assemble, and crows gather again over Paris. Welcome to Francia! What? No sniveling emissary from King Charles to greet us? Believe me, Wolfkist, you will feel the warmth of his welcome soon enough. The mad king did this. We all had a part in it. What's the meaning of this? Gods. This is what he would bring to Ravenstorm. It is. We are almost there. But we cannot take the longship around Paris as the Frank's bridges block the way. Our village is inland. We will take the horses from here. The others will follow on foot. Is there danger of an ambush? Not this close to the water. And not at night. Siegfried has done his work too well. I will finish unloading the ship. You two go ahead. Many thanks, Pierre. And Eivor. There is something we should talk about when I arrive at Melun. Until then, ride safe. Mount up! The ride is not long. How will I face Siegfried? He entrusted me to gather axes. He wants me to leave one day. How will I face Siegfried? He entrusted me to gather axes. He wants me to lead one day. But I failed even this. The failure was not all yours, Tuka. Jarls are ever busy with their own concerns. And a good fight. What else matters? Frankish scouts. They have been watching us closely of late. What do you think it means? <coughs> that Siegfried has not finished his work yet. Siegfried will not be finished until there are no more Franks left to fight. Scouts have been gnawing at our heels ever since Charles forced us from the north. He pushed. He pushes hard against your people. You might have to lead sooner than you expect, Toga. I may not be the best one to do it. I see the longhouse. We are almost there. back after so long. I thought to return with an army. Welcome to Milan. We should find Siegfried. Look about it. Toka, you have returned. All went well, I hope. Are the others you brought coming behind you? I need to find Siegfried. Of course. Well, uh, you will find him where he always is. Ah, yes. He will be at the burial grounds, staring into the mist. It is where he begins most days. This way.
our burial grounds. Simric, my father, lies there, with the others. We should go. There's something calming about this place. It is a beautiful land. Or would be if it was not filled with Franks. There is Siegfried. You go ahead. He may not be happy to see me return with so few allies. Siegfried. You came, Wolfskist. Good. You knew it was me. Pierre sent word ahead. Your axe will be a boon to us. I heard your axe has been busy as well. Yes, I've slain many on the open field with honor. As Odin intended. It is our way. But it is not their way. The Franks dragged our Jarl Sinric from his bed and gutted him like a coward. They did not even bury him, just left his body for the animals to take. I raised this mount for him. You want me to join your side against these Franks? There is no side. There is only blood debt and vengeance and Helheim for those I split with my axe. I'm sorry for your sword brother, Siegfried. Odin himself will grant you your vengeance. But my first duty is to my own clan. Uh, that is a fair saying when you are in England. You are in Frankia now. Now we will feast, and I will tell you of my plans for Paris. This is Vidar, a more noble beast I have never known. The God of Vengeance. It is a good name. Many Franks have met their end beneath his iron hoofs. He hates them almost as much as I do. You placed the carving at Sinric's grave. Sinric won it from me in the home gang when we were children. It is Eikthirni who watches over Odin's hall in Valhalla. He was holding it when I found him. It was the only way I knew him after the animals had gotten to his body. will be the greatest raid since Ragnar sacked Paris and brought longships full of silver back to King Horik. We will fill our war chest with silver and our mugs with mead. Blood and glory! Skull! This is not just about silver, Torka. He hates being disturbed while he eats. You know, Ragnar returned with more than just silver. More than silver? What was it? Swords, precious jewels, wine! Stories of a dead saint defending Paris. Horik was so awed, he freed the Christians and executed his raiders. Really? 
That does not sound glorious. Behold, I will deliver thine enemy into thine hand, that thou mayest do to him as it shall seem good to thee. Kill the heathens! Bring me Siegfried's head, and that one as well! Leave the stripling alive to tell of it! The what? Bishop Anglin, this is a good night. Oh shit. This area is off limits. Horses give them advantage, but it will not be enough. God grant she strength! Siegfried, wait! What did he say to you? Toka, see to the wounded, and find the watch! They should have warned us of the attack! I told you he doesn't like to be interrupted while eating. We needed that soldier alive to question. Wild heart, level head. Oh, I like that. Where is Siegfried going? My guess is to find that bishop, Engelwin. He hates him above all others. It was he who killed Sinric. Yes, his sword brother. And your father. I'm sorry, Toga. Nothing has changed. If anything, the attacks grow more frequent, as you see. Randri was right. I have to stop this before it reaches Ravensthorpe. <sighs> Unless you can convince their king to surrender, you may have to kill every soldier in Francia. This battle will not be won with Axis. I must find a way to meet Charles. Convince him not to attack England. Remember, Charles murdered Gottfried. He will not honor his word. Better to kill him. The problem is bigger than one king, Toga. I must talk to him. It is what my clan expects. You may be right. But I am not the one you will have to convince in the end. If you kill Engelwin, Siegfried might be persuaded to help you find Charles. You begin to think like a Jarl, Toka. Twice our scouts followed Engelwin to the slums south of Paris. When you are ready, that is where Siegfried will be. I will meet Siegfried there and return when Engelwin is dead. Then, we will find Charles. Evor, over here! Yeah. We have a shared interest. You in resisting Francia's north loathing loyalists, me in getting paid. Those do not seem connected. I am working with a rogue band of men and women across Francia who tire of the chaos Charles's rule brought. Their numbers are small. Few are foolish enough to resist well-equipped loyalist forces. You do not believe in their cause? I do not, but they do. This is where you come in. Help them, and you will have ample reward for your effort. It is strange that you support them while believing their cause ill-fated. What kind of monster would I be if I were to dash the hope they hold in their hearts? Anyway, there is profit to be made, and only a fool ignores that. So, what will it be? Show me what is available. Nothing to your life. I'll be back. Well, you know where to find me if you... If 
Siegfried has his way, there will not be a single Frank left in these hills by winter. He hates them. How did you find me? Where is Tolka? Tolka guessed you would be here. She is still at Milan, looking for your missing watch. Uh, I lost Engelwin, but this soldier told me he is heading for the church nearby. Come, we can go through the slums. Ah, even from here I can smell the piss of the slums. Siegfried, I mean to stop this fight from coming to England. I must meet with Charles. For what? You cannot buy me scrolls. Have you forgotten my fallen brother, Simric? No, and that is why I must try. It is why I came to Frank here. If I kill Engelman, I want you to help me get an audience with the king. There is no reasoning with you, Wolfkist. You are as wild as your namesake. runs the blood of holy kings and conquerors. The northerners may have numbers, but we have God. <sighs> that is all, though. Count of Paris and right-hand man to the king. Drumming up support for his army, no doubt. Our courage and honor will not fail us, no matter how hot the fight. We will overcome this evil, as we always have. Self-important as always. The one next to him is Gosselin, bishop of Paris and a fearsome warrior. For a Frank. Those two are for another day. You have to get to Engelwin, and to do that, you have to find your way into the church. The answer is down there in that stink. That is not much to go on. If it was easy, I would have killed him myself already. You have an advantage. You are unknown to these... 
The Raider Siegfried is almost at our gates. And what does he want? What the Northerners always want. Blood and silver. Yours and mine. Me, they know quite well already. Someone down there knows something. All you have to do is get them to tell you. I have your word. Once this is done, we find Charles. As you say, but work fast. I cannot leave Miller on guard in long. This Frankish stench already turns my stomach. Three guards, insulting. I will deal with them while you find Engelwyn. He is hiding in his church. Will you sneak in? Convince one of his own to aid you? Or cover the streets with blood? As you would? They deserve no less. But you are the wolf kissed. You do not need my advice. So what will you do? I will find my own way. Count Odo is the protector of Paris, the king's man, and he has told you the truth. You cannot trust the Northmen. Bread or coin? Bread or coin? Are you the owner? Oh no. <laughs> That's such a naively hopeful world. What can I get you? You have a good crowd. If you mean tables of soldiers drowning themselves in wine at my expense, then yes, it's good enough. It might be better if not for that old drunk over there, crying about the bishop to everyone who listened. <sighs> I'd send him away, but to be honest, I need his business. I need to find the bishop. <laughs> the bishop? I can tell you he's not in this mud pit, my friend. He wouldn't risk soiling his holy sandals. There is a priest who does the bishop's numbers in here at times. Last I saw, he was talking to a table of soldiers. Thanks for the help. You look the kind that enjoys a good complaint. You'll be back. Wine loosens lips as well as ale. Someone at the tavern might know something that will get me into the church. Someone needs to report back to the bishop. Tell him the nosy scrub is taken care of. Well, not me. My cup isn't empty yet. And that bishop makes me uneasy. For a servant of God, he has a terrible temper. I could look for the scribe at the plague district. I'll see if someone here. You mentioned the bishop. Oh, he took her, my daughter. She's gone. She's a good girl. Never any trouble. She wouldn't steal anything. Who took your daughter? Was it the bishop? The bishop's soldiers in the slums. Said she stole the bishop's silver. Said she has a devil. Needs deliverance. Where's her? What did you say? I will find your daughter here in the slums, and she will help me find Engelwyn. I could look for the scribe at the Plague District. I could look for the scribe at the... I could look for the scribe at the Plague District. I'll see if someone here knows something more. That is two good leads. Sorry, work 
close down here. Try your luck back upstairs. Did you hear that priest? Hey! He was talking about deliverance. Always talking, usually about offerings. You wouldn't think God himself was poor if you listened to them. Shh! Don't say such things. You'll be taken for a heretic and sent for deliverance yourself.
need to find Bishop Engelman. Do you know where he is? If you are here for deliverance, you have a long wait. My brother has been upstairs waiting for hours now. Are you here for deliverance? Y yes. I, I don't know. I want to be close to God, but those screams don't seem right. Does it seem right to you? Your deliverance ritual, it is with Engelman. Uh, yes. He does it alone. I, I'm next in line and I, I, I don't think I want this. I could take your place and see Engelman for you. Then you could leave. Tell me what I must do. You need a robe. They won't let you in without their special robe. Then you go down the corridor and talk to the priest. Give me a robe. My robe? But, but they gave me one, but um, I didn't put it on. I, I left it somewhere around here. I will find it and take your place. You should leave now before they call for you. Yes. Y yes, you're right. Uh, as soon as my nerves settle, I'll go. It's been a robe I need. It's well made. I see you are ready for the... Take this key. Prepare your heart and when you are ready, enter through this door. The bishop is waiting for you. I see you are ready for the ritual. Welcome, traveler. Your eyes are covered, yet you see me. Justice and innocence are both blind, yet see more clearly, boys. Find them, light the way, and see the treasures of God. God is light, and in Him is no darkness at all. The way through darkness to your deliverance is clear when it is lit by God. It is a red... The way to deliverance. That was me and Engelman. Without them, we are blind. Naked you came from your mother's womb, and naked you will return. Enter here.
crest and the key. This has a lot of wealth. Englewen would make a good raider. Amen. I will see you late. Are you? Bishop Engelwyn sent me with word for the king. Did he now? And did he happen to send you with the watchword? I have an urgent message for the king. If he does not receive it, I will be sure to tell the bishop why and who. You are one of his northern spies, I suppose. I heard there was trouble. All right, stand back. Now to find the king.
Not an enemy. Not yet. I am Eivor of the Raven Clan in England. <sighs> Flesh and blood. A northerner by the look of you. Why do you disturb me? Where are my guards? Your guards are not coming. Your bishop will not be joining us either. <laughs> Engelwin, you've done me a favor, Northerner. Though you don't know it. That bishop was an unholy annoyance. What is it you want? Your soldiers strike at Norse villages. Their attacks grow more common by the day. You make war against us without cause. <laughs> without cause? This is my land. A kingdom established by God. You are invaders and devils, a scourge I am called to cleanse. My cause is God himself. War is uncertain and dangerous. Often begins in one place, only to end unfavorably in another. War is war. But you mean England? Oh, yes. I understand you, Diable. You came to plead for your own neck. I came to make an agreement to save many necks. Perhaps even your own. You murder your way into another land. And you think to stop me driving you back out with negotiation? I am a king. You are a godless invader. Who are you to parley with me? I am one who might have killed you already, yet you live. Hmm. Perhaps this is opportune. What do you think? Could it work? Hmm. It might work. There is something I require. If you accomplish it, I will be more open to consider your... proposal. A deal within a deal. How like a king. What is this task? My queen, Richardis, has been taken. I want her return to me. I assume I must first find her. My spies tell me she was taken by those belonging to a zealous faction within the church. I know nothing more. You do not seem overly troubled by her absence. Marriage for kings is more often a matter of politics than of the heart. In any case, I doubt she is in danger. And you can be certain. I want her safe return. If I do this, you will agree to leave England in peace. Peace? That's a strange word in the mouth of an invader. But again, you presume too much. Do this, and you will have earned a place at the negotiation table. Nothing more. When we next meet, it will be with your queen to discuss your ambitions for England. As you say, Diablo, God will make it so. Now, you must excuse me. It is not right. They dishonored our brothers. Sintrip will make sure that...
átti jarl við nokkuð, þá er ég bannað. Wolfkist, you are gone over long. We've had trouble. Engelwin is dead. Though there is a sickness in these franks, I do not understand. That is very good. It is as I told you. You see now why it is pointless to try to deal with them. Yet I must. Information with him led me to their king. Charles and I have reached the beginnings of an agreement. You met with their king? Do you make yourself my enemy now? Toka failed to bring me any but you, and now you defy me! You said there was trouble. There was another attack. We found our missing watch. Curse those raven starvers. I will gut every one of them! You might have helped prevent this. Why? What has happened? You will see what it is you are so eager to make peace with. Toka will show you. I have our revenge to plan. Come with me, Wolfkist. You remember our missing watch? While you and Siegfried went after Engelwin, I searched for them. But they were gone. After the second attack, we found them. What do you mean? Where were they? Come and see. were not made by the sword, or by animals. It is the Franks. You said yourself, there is a sickness in them. There is no honor in what they do. These were my friends. I have seen this before. People disappear sometimes. When they return, they are like this. Toga, I need your help. Charles asked me to find his queen. If I can, I might stop this sickness reaching England. The queen was at Evreux yesterday, in the company of priests. You will find her there. You think all I do is drink wine and bed handsome men and beautiful women? Merde. I have eyes all over Francia, and they see many things. Some of those things I must attend to now. When you have the time, Evor, come and see me. I have more work for you. Siegfried is right, Wolfkist. Even with this proof of the Franks' cowardice before you, you still want to bargain with them? I will not go against my uncle. I am sorry. I cannot help you in this. You're right. Your duty is to your own clan, Toka. My duty is to mine. It is why I came to Frankia. I will go to Ebre alone. When you are done in Evreux, meet us at our forward camp, west of Paris. We have a siege to prepare. Charles's army is from England. I must find his queen. She was seen with priests at Evera. That is where I must go. <laughs> <laughs> 